Sup, 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 my name is Rio for the Yu-Gi-Oh! Council. We got another Shining Victory spoiler, and this one's actually extremely good. Let me introduce you to Gendo, the Master Monk. So, face-up attack position monsters on field cannot activate their effects. The defense position card, this defense position card, cannot be targeted by card effects or destroyed by card effects. This instantly will stop searches. This instantly will slow down the game because you make all your power plays and then you pendulum summon him in defense mode. And look, another reason why pendulum's stupid. Ha! <laughs> In all seriousness, it's a great anti-meta card. That's what it's supposed to be designed for, but I don't think anyone at Konami actually tested this. Because, hey, you play Magician. Hey, you play Perform Pal and Friends. Hey, you play Drago Slayer! And you just drop this shit on the board, and you drop it in defense mode, and your opponent instantly cannot special, like, uh, they can special summon. They can't, like, search. They can't go for their monster effect play. Because, let's be honest, What's the most powerful thing in the meta right now, like for starting monsters, it's 1800. Now Wisdom Eye is something that gets over it, OCG doesn't have Wisdom Eye. This thing can't be destroyed by Rekaki, Dark Hole, or nothing of that sort. He's got a fucking cat mask on, and he's part of the main core set for Shining Victories. That alone is just hilarious. Everyone's gonna say, hey look, it's just an anti-meta card, and disregard it. Don't be that guy. This is not just an anti-meta card. This is the card you slap in your deck and you say you can't play Yu-Gi-Oh! with Miss Pex Avion. You play both of them in your Magicians and then your opponent can't do Squad because they can't get over this one thing. And if they can, you got the Miss Pex Avion. And if you really want to get Saki, you could play a card called Shift and change the direction of attack from this guy, if they have something with 1850 or over, into the Mispex Avion. So, there's that. But all jokes aside, this card's amazing in the core set for Shining Victories. It looks to be number 41. My eyes are going right now. It's been... It's it's really early here where I am. So anyway, thank you guys for watching. I'm technically releasing this video from my end in 2016 to the past in 2015. Think about that because it's quite funny. But uh, in all seriousness, I, what's going to happen next couple of days till uh, Monday US time it's going to slow down videos just gonna be a couple deck profiles I've yet to post up uh, starting today and then the next meta on Sunday and then Monday we'll go back to our normal schedule of everything and I'll be back in my work deck, in my work ethic and I have a couple decks that I'm cooking up right now that I think you'll like that are not the same old same old you'll get those same old same old but you need to get the other stuff too. So they'll start rolling out Monday. So anyway, thank you guys for watching. Make sure to subscribe for more if you enjoy the content and you're excited and you're hyped if you haven't subscribed already. Follow me on Twitch. There's a link down in the description. I always put the links uh, for the other channels and everything there. You can check them out there and I'll see you later. Thanks for watching.